A well-known Adelaide architect has been killed in the latest of five fatal crashes in South Australia this week. David Cheney's motorbike collided with a turning car near the toll gate this morning, prompting an urgent call to take more care on the roads. David Cheney's devastated loved ones rushed to the scene of the shocking crash, but the respected architect and builder was already dead. His high-powered motorbike and the car bearing the brunt of the impact. The bike stopped pretty much and the rider just ragdolled. I couldn't ambulance straight away, but um, I think it was too late. The 56-year-old has built some of Adelaide's most prestigious homes. He was on a weekly ride to Goolwa with mates when the crash happened in the 60 km an hour zone up track near the toll gate just after 7am. The driver of the car escaped with minor injuries. It definitely stopped before it pulled out and I think the motorbike was going pretty fast. Major Crash now investigating that claim. It's been a horror week on our state's roads. Last night, a 27-year-old Windvale man died after rolling his car on the barrier highway at Riverton. On Wednesday night, a woman was killed and her son badly burned in a fiery crash near Truro. The other driver has been charged. Earlier in the week, two drivers in their 20s were both killed in single car accidents. The spate of tragedies has prompted a fresh warning from the Motor Accident Commission for drivers to take extra care while on the road. Almost 50% of our fatalities every year are a result of people engaging in extreme behaviour and that is completely unacceptable. Rhett Burney, Nine News.